your alley. Pat adores flowers, but at this time of year for so many of us, uh, we really just have nothing coming into our gardens. So true. I mean, it was cold today yes. and we've been so lucky with our weather out here. This is an expiring offer. The price that you see on the screen, this is going away. That price will disappear at the end of the day. We've got our five easy pay payments on it. These are really large metal sculpted flowers which are designed to hang directly on the wall, but these work indoors or outdoors. They do, they do. And they're by Plow and Hearth, and yep. Plow and Hearth is that company that's going to give you all those wonderful items to help add distinction to your home, beauty, things that are going to stand out. And I love this wall art. You do too. You love their wall art. I'm so thrilled with this new piece. This, I was going to say, brand new to us. Welcome back, Nancy. This Thank is you Nancy so Brambola. much for having me. She's our Hello. representative from the folks at Plow and Hearth. Plow and Hearth, uh, I say this often, I don't consider them a manufacturer. I consider them kind of an artisan village yes. because everything they do in this case is done by hand, individually painted by one person and put together. Mm -hmm. Which flower is it? This one is a magnolia and we have it in three different choices. So you have it in white, which I have hanging on the door. Looks gorgeous in replacing a wreath if you want to do something unique and different. I'm holding pink and then on the wall we have above you, I believe we're calling that fuchsia. It's like yeah. a deeper pink. And so each one is handcrafted. They are made of layers and layers of metal. And as I show you the one up close here, I want you to notice some of the gorgeous details because it is really spectacular. This is more of an elegant piece, I think, for Kapala Hearth. I agree. Hearth. And it's not a tiny piece. It's almost right. 20 inches from, from bottom to top. Mm -hmm. And it is three dimensional. So yes, it is. It's about, yeah, about four inches. I noticed that you had one as a centerpiece and put a candle in the I middle. Did. Just, yeah, we'll go that over was a great and, look too. and see that in just a minute. But up here, I want you to see this is done in a matte finish. This is made out of metal. Look at the gold here. There's embossing to make those veins stand out. There's also tips of gold on the veins as well as around the edges of the leaves and the petals. And I'm not even sure if you can see, but actually there's veining in here on the petals themselves. Look at the sponge painting. The way they get the veining, they, they take they take a, a small flat chisel and on the back side they tap it out. It's and amazing. that's what creates that ridge line. Yep. And look at even the center of the flower, all the layers of metal. This is such a beautiful piece. You can use this indoors, you can use it outside. It's going to arrive a little bit flatter, but you can position the petals a little bit if you'd like to. Okay. Now again, when you say outdoors and be careful you're gonna mm -hmm. take stuff. Um, I don't have to worry about the elements? You know, I would say pretty much no, but if you're someone that's getting lots and lots of snow right now, my recommendation would be go ahead and enjoy it inside because okay. you don't want this layered in snow, but really for most so of the covered country. covered patio, something like that, that's and, okay. And during the nicer spring months when you're outside, go ahead and enjoy it outside. Okay. Put it on All the right. fence line, put it on the gate, put it on that outside wall. Just, you're not going to enjoy it right now if it's in the middle of winter time. So I, I like use the it way, inside. I like the way they look in multiples. Beautiful. Yeah. Look at how I've hung it right here on the windows. So if this is, you know, like during your nicer weather, you can use it out here. And again, if you live in California or Florida, don't worry about it. You all know, the it's the, all the time yeah. is fine. But I want you to enjoy these because truly when I saw these, I was amazed at the artistry and just how elegant and beautiful of a piece it is. I would use this in a dining room. I okay. would use this, at, like you said, in multiples. I'd love to see it over kitchen cabinets, you know, that have that kind of empty space. Yep. Look oh, how pretty that's these are. That's my fat head that just stepped right into the shot. <laughs> Aww. And I like mixing the colors around too. I wouldn't feel like you have to match, you know, your fuchsia with fuchsia. I love this look with a light one and then a darker one. And we did it on the table yeah. here. This white is already final call. Oh my goodness. Uh, these won't last. That price, by the way, again, is an expiring price. That goes away at the end of the day. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And some of our biggest gardening shows are still yet to occur. Absolutely. So they'll be coming up in the next couple weeks. Look at all those layers. It's so pretty. And all I did was I just took a luminara, con a luminara candle and I set it in the center right here. That could be a centerpiece in your dining room out on your patio during the summertime. We want to try it with the pink? Yeah, it's beautiful. It is so pretty. I, I truly love this piece so much. You can have this if you have a special celebration at Easter time and you're looking for a centerpiece that's different. Right. Look how gorgeous this is. And this is going to last and last where fresh flowers, they don't. But maybe you could even put a small vase of fresh flowers in the center of it. I'm going to swap it out because I want you to see All it right. with the pink. Here, and I'll let you that. hold the white. Sure. 
There we go. So I'm just simply going to take this and place it in the center of the table. Imagine this is your dining room table or maybe a coffee table. And there you just put a candle in the center and you have something so elegant. And this is by Plow and Hearth. So you know the quality is second to none. And this is all metal construction. The hang tag on the back that's already installed for you. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, when you do get it home, it is packed flat. So you will take just a little bit of pressure to bend these leaves up to give it a, a three dimensional design. It's roughly 19 inches from mm -hmm. top to bottom, about the same from side to side. These are well done. These are so gorgeous. I really just fell in love with these when I saw these when I went down to Plow and Hearth. They are so spectacular. A little more on the elegant side. If you're looking yep. to really elevate that dining room space, your space outside, you can use these outside. Right. I just would say if you're spending time inside right now because your weather's awful outside, how about finding that spot right near your fireplace or in a dining room to enjoy them now and then go outside and enjoy them on your fence line, your gate, wherever you'd like to do them. Today could be very well the only day where you see it with free shipping and handling and I know with that expiring price going away that you're going to pay more for it tomorrow. Pick up the white that's very limited. By the way, the fuchsia is also very, very limited. Okay. It's always good to see you. Thank you so much, Dan. Thank you. Let me give you an update. Our, our SpongeBob SquarePants. By the way, just saying that makes me laugh. I'm sorry. Uh, our, our scrub daddy sold out. They are completely gone. Coming up a little bit later on, our friends from Roberta.